While everyone was sleeping, USA, Team USA captured its first medal. Good news to report this morning. It was a silver finish in women's snowboarding slope style event. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, good news there. Turning now to our forecast as we take a beautiful look over Southfield. It's cold out there, but look at that gorgeous sun starting to wake up with us. I know it's so gorgeous to yeah. see that sunrise coming up in February with all that sunshine. Don't always see that. As a matter of fact, we often don't see that. So we're, it's nice to grab the sunglasses headed out, whether you're headed out to Sunday services, grabbing brunch or maybe doing some grocery shopping this morning and keep them handy for the afternoon too. 18 degrees in Detroit, 13 in Wyandotte in the mid teens in both Novi and Plymouth coming in at 15 degrees like Southfield and KPAC as well. Romeo also at 15 degrees, so it's nice to see those temperatures at least closer to average. Upper teens is what we average, so we're pretty close to that. As we head through the day today, a south to southwest wind will pick up just a bit, so we could see gusts 20 to 25. And so when we see those gusts up there, then of course we talk about our wind chill temperature. Right now, winds about 10 to 15, and it puts us at two degrees right now in Pontiac, in Mount Clemens as well. Feels like three below in Ann Arbor. Our high temperatures today, we should be very close to 30 degrees this afternoon. We were at 20 yesterday, so almost 10 degrees, if not 10 degrees uh, milder than yesterday. And then as far as our wind chills, we'll stay in the teens, especially when we see those higher gusts. Looking at the radar, the satellite composite, things look good, mostly clear sky overhead. We do have more clouds back to the west. Those will increase overnight and the system will skirt through during the day tomorrow. It'll come through in the morning, bring us a chance for maybe some light snow in the tail end of the morning into the afternoon afternoon or even looking at a few flurries. Now today, of course, it's sunshine, not as cold, but this is for tomorrow. We'll see that in spots as we go through our Monday. Tuesday, it's because of the cold front coming through. It'll drop our temperatures off several degrees from our Monday's highs. So Tuesday, a little bit colder. We get into the middle of the week on Wednesday and with temperatures above freezing, could see more of a rain snow mix or even some snow, depending on how late in the day it comes in. There's a, a little bit of a question mark. Again, it looks like it is going to be late in the evening and overnight that we see a few of those snow showers on Wednesday. So of course, that would be more likely to come down as snow versus a mix. But temperatures today, upper 20s to near 30 degrees under that sunshine, so we are in good shape there. 32 tomorrow, and then taking a little step back, as I mentioned on Tuesday, high of 27 degrees. We make it into the mid 30s on Wednesday, Thursday night into Friday. That's when we could see more snow and temperatures still at or above freezing through Friday. Just a little.